The following contest is a triple threat, one fall to a finish match. So everybody remembers, with a 30 minute time limit, this match is one fall. Had to get it out of the way. Introducing first. Second entered in this triple threat match. in the triple threat one fall match. City, Mexico, the KO boy, Guillermo Mosada. And the third entrant, weighing in at 145 pounds, from the Rose City, Portland, Oregon, introducing Jaden. Chris Samuel. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have a three-way dance here. We're back. Powell Pro Wrestling here in Eugene, Oregon. 
it's still weird for me to do this. Inter introduction thing. Sorry, man. You're going to get used to it. Yeah. We'll figure it out. So, so Funny Bun pretty much scared me half to death. I right. forgot what I was doing. Right. No, I understand. I don't think much of this match is going to be done in the ring. I don't see a whole lot of holds and yeah, counter holds. There's not many. I don't know. I mean, I can see two being air assault. One, one looks like a more grounded pound, but we'll see. All right. Don't judge a book by its cover, so I'm going to try not to. There's Sonico coming off a tour of Japan with Pro Wrestling Noah. When I uh, was in the back and I asked Jaden, what do you weigh? He said, uh, 145 pounds. And I'm like, no, no, not what you weighed in the sixth grade. Right. What do you weigh now? And he said, no, 145. I was like, oh, okay. So, and he said, I am in sixth grade. Yeah, I was like, oh, so, I'm just kidding. I, I, I poke fun being a pro wrestler. Both of us she shock myself. You know, I mean, I poke fun at the smaller guys. But the thing is, is oh, these are our kids that are going to be our future right here. No, I'm not going to see Whitney Houston. I was, I was seeing if you're coming with that. Yep. This is fast-paced action. Packed action. Yep. Fast-paced action, packed action. It's a little too hard to call sometimes. Oh! oh. Into a wheelbarrow. Oh. Wheelbarrow case the door into an arm drag. Probably should let me handle doing the moves because I know this is way yeah. out of your league. Way, folks, sorry, this is way past my... Uh, they throw, if they throw, a, you know, a body slam, right. then, you know, I'll okay, get you. I know a schoolboy when I see one. Jaden looks like he is in firm control at this point. Yeah, where'd the other one go? I don't know. Oh, he's on the ground. He's on the ground outside. Yeah. And by, by no means do I mean any disrespect. I, these three athletes are absolutely 100% new to me. Well, oh! oh! Right in the two pieces. Line with the feet. Line. Usually they call that a kick. Oh, well, well, he's got it, but he can't, you know. It's a spin. He'll kick without a spin. Uh -huh. Ross is doing the smart thing and keeping Sonic on the outside. All right. You got to ground these guys, man. They're flyers. Every time I've ever had a high flyer in a match, man, we went straight to the ground. And I did not let him get off, off his feet. Except for on his back. No matter how much the crowd cheered, you just held on to that yeah, headlock. Held on to that headlock. Oh. Kind of like this. Well, no. Wow, power. Woo! That's a hell of a move, kid. Wow, I you see went. I see you right there. He blocked that tilt world DDT into an X-Plex. An X-Plex? I told you, this is my expertise. All right, I'll let you run. Sonic go up and over. Springboard arm drag. Oh, reverse into a backbreaker. Rosas won our last match. Back up. Head scissor takedown. Is that a Hurricanrana? That is a head scissor takedown, oh. not a Hurricanrana. Oh, There's okay. a difference. There is a difference? Yes. The difference is you got to jump up and wrap your. Yes. Oh, okay. I'm getting it, folks. I'm learning something, a thing or two with this Ninja Libre. I never watched the movie. <laughs> he didn't miss much. <laughs> Maybe if I did, I'd have prepared, prepared for... Not, no, for no? sure you wouldn't. Oh, okay. No! Jaden, he's looking for something. Oh, DDT Flatliner. That, what? Just go with it. Okay, DDT Flatliner. Atta boy. Whatever it did, it worked. Yes. I mean, it's, that was... I mean, it, All three men are down, though. Absolutely. All three men are down. Well, that was feeling... White Gloves is going to pop up here pretty soon. <laughs> His name is Jaden. Oh, Jaden. I'm impressed. Don't get me wrong. Don't, don't. Well, hey, but you're right. He popped right up. Yep. Rosas and Sonic on the outside. Freak of Flyer Miles coming. People are getting out of the way because they know. Yeah. Whoa! Woo! I couldn't see him. He looked like he hit his head. Looked like uh, White Gloves hit his head. Again, that's Jaden. Oh, Jaden, yeah. And he's up. He, he, well, he must not hit it too hard. That was a suicide dive to the outside. And not a tope suicido. A what? Yeah, just go with it. It's tope, not. Tope suicido. Yes. Okay. I know I said that perfectly. Mama say, mama sa, mama kusa. Oh, we got we got white gloves. Yeah. 
So Rosas understands that the hardest part of the ring is the uh, the post. Absolutely. He's taking advantage of that. As I would. I do. Very often. I like to hear the skull on the end of that metal frame. When it goes bow, 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 bow. And then that instant lump that forms in the forehead. Five minutes down. Five minutes have expired in this match. Throwing some Muay Thai knees to Sonico. Uh oh. You think he learned that? Oh! oh! Dragon! Oh! Dragon suplex to the outside oh, to will, the floor. I will let the, the fans say it. Yeah, I'm not going to cuss, but that was a holy, you know what? Uh, white gloves might be dead. Dude, white gloves might be. White gloves might have red gloves. That's not going to hurt. That. Woo! Rosas is laying in wait. He's, he's a little worse for wear at this well, point. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to save him a Salamakusan right there. I mean. Oh! Big chop from Sonico. Now he's got a big chest, a big target. That might have fired up Rosas. Oh, it did. Some people, it wakes him up. Well, he used to wake me up. I'll tell you that first three. I couldn't get going until I got that third one. Man, it really just lit a fire under my rear end. Oh, oh it looks like. J Jaden was trying to pop up Jayden there, but. tried, but. Looks like. Uh, his feet look like a baby calf. <laughs> uh oh. Where are you going? What's going on? There's a little, there's a little girl in the crowd. Yeah, a little girl in the crowd. That's a little tiny girl. Don't hit that little girl. I don't need. We don't need any. We don't need any Saint Jude's and stuff like that. We don't need. God bless Saint Jude's. But. Yeah. <coughs> Rose is having none of that. No. It, well, anything you can do, I can do. Louder. Bubba Blanchard up there giving uh, White Gloves a little encouragement. I, I think he's a little bit out of his element. Bubba Blanchard has never flown ever in his life. Okay, you're right. On a plane, yes. yes. Oh, to the post. Well, I, he might be checking to see if uh, if, uh, if, if Jaden's conscious. If, if, <laughs> white Gloves just knows where he's at. Hey, do you know why you're wearing White Gloves? No. Okay, you're fine. Oh. oh. If if he did, wasn't concussed now, he uh, dead. He was now. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, that, hard, that hit was so hard it, it rattled me for a second. I mean, got super flexible. Nice. Well, that was what Jaden was doing with it. Oh, uh, uh, more and more selling. Yeah. <clears throat> Give it to me, White Gloves. Oh! oh! Caught him right on the jaw, did Rosas. You think White Gloves is playing possum? No, he got hit hard. I think he one, two, only a two count. No, I think he's probably doing a better job of playing dead. He's having a hard time climbing up on the ring. He's tried three or four times, and yep. each time to no <clears throat> avail. I mean, he's getting close to his steps, so I mean, he could for sure do that. There's a Huracurana. Aha! I knew I would see one. It's only a matter of time. I gave one one time. <laughs> no, you didn't. You're right. <laughs> Sonico up, over, and Whoa! out. Oh! Dive to the outside. That is a very high risk maneuver. Now he's sitting down, kind of happy with himself on what he just did. Well, I mean, he, Rosas looks like he's down. Jaden trying to get up on the steps because he's trying to regain consciousness. Dude, Jaden ain't. Yo, Jaden don't know where he's at. If he gets in the ring, he's still not going to know why he's there. Right. You might think he's back in Portland. You never know. The Rose. Welcome to the Rose City. Referee Chris Samuels trying to get some order going here. All three men are on the outside. We're, we're, I'm waiting for a count. We haven't seen count one yet. The city of Roses smells like poo-poo right now. Poo-poo-poo. Yep. That's because they have that 40-foot uh, poo-poo emoji. Well, yeah. Oh! I don't care if you're wearing a mask. That's going to send you loop. Yeah. Loop. Nice, white oh. teeth, Betty poo He just walked by and kicked Jaden in the face. Well, good. You're just sitting there. You're not doing anything. Oh, wait a minute. I lied. White gloves got up and struck him right in the jaw. Up up. Oh! That's a oh, Head scissor takedown. Okay, I lied. Same difference to you at this yes, point. At this point, I can't tell. I'm going to let you call him. Well, my monitor went out. I can't see over that far over. Where's he going? He's going to do another one. Big flying forearm off the steps. So maybe White Gloves was playing a little possum. Maybe. Trying to get his energy level back up. Right. Like, you know, more combat style. Burr, burr, burr. Yep. Tap A a bunch of times. Yep. Your, your power goes up. Yep. Going for the cover. 
Might be it. Two. On the two count. I felt like there was too much time in between there and they hit the throw in the ring. Now and ten minutes prior to this match. Kick it off the knees. Oh, good knee by Sonico. Whoa! Whoa! Springboard reverse heel kick. I don't Going think. Going for three. One, two. I don't think De La Rosa is going to allow this. Uh, yeah, he didn't allow it to happen. Wait, that's a reverse. That's a, like, I like that. I mean, that's like a little hopscotch that's reverse. A little, little okey doke to the yep, outside. That was an okey doke. Oh, good. Axe kick. Oh. Front kick. Right in his waiting, loving arms. Oh, right into a flatliner. Done. That's got to be it. That's it. That's got to be it. One, two, kick. Only wow. a two count. Two. I almost rang the bell. This close, my friends. It's too late. Turn back now. Jaden is uh, in a bad way, that's for yeah. sure. Jaden's in trouble. Oh, God. good Lord. Jaden will be having his meal through a straw tonight, folks. Yeah. I guarantee you that. Something tells me Sonico uh, learned a thing or two when he was over in Japan. And, well, yeah. And they were not nice. He just made white gloves pucker two places. Woo. Russell's working his way back in the ring. Oh. oh. Big spear by Gemma Rosas. Interception. See. The strap's going to come down. Oh, it, it should. If he, knew, if he knew what with the damage he could cause if that strap went down. He's not old enough to know Jerry no, Lawler, he's so. Not. Well, he might, but the announcer Jerry Lawler. He doesn't know about the strap. Oh, good gravy. Oh, man. Just the pure sound. Uh oh. Uh oh. Double headbutt. German. German. No, roll, roll through. Oh, wow. Oh, double German into a pin. Wow, that could have oh. been. Wow. Wow! I would have to ask referee Chris Samuels who would have got that pin because I don't know. Yeah, who would have? I don't know. I mean, there's a bunch of shoulders down right there, right? All three, All three of you three guys. Of All three of you guys done. That would have been great, actually. I would, that's a first. Order. I've never seen that. We're all three men in a three-way lose on a pin. Yeah. Rosa's first one up to his feet. Oh, right in the... Is it going for a pedigree? No, I'm going say white gloves. Whoa, white gloves. Going to break up a pin. One way, that's one, one way that's to do one it. One way to do it. <coughs> Jaden better go for a pin and go for a pin quick. Jaden better, yeah, he better go for a pin quick. He's got a BMX bag right, race to do after this. I mean, who's the oh. gloves? Well. Dude, that or he's got a softball tournament. Oh, yeah, it's, he's got Dean Marini gloves. <laughs> yeah, Marosa catches that kick. Whoa, right across the face. There's a, that's a fresh one. He was he was slapping him like he owes him money. Well, he probably does. Let's face back. Oh. You and I both oh. know about knee problems. In the middle of the ring. In the middle. No, 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 yeah, I, I think he's got him in the middle. I can't tell. Is, is he close? Oh, Sonico's comes, working his way to the top, though. Here comes Sinico. Double knees from the top. Trying to loot that press. That's a double knees. Oh. Oh! oh. Only a two only count. Only two, only two. Dang. Lucky he's wearing a belt. These guys have done more moves. Oh! oh. I did my whole career. Sick kick, here it comes. One, two, three. Here is your winner, Kabuki Jaguar Sonico! Well, on the bright side, you learned about half a dozen new moves you've never seen before. And I would say right now, in five minutes, I'll forget them all. Probably. You didn't have a lot. Well, Sonico is your winner of this triple threat one fall to a finished match. Woo! I, very nice. The Seattle Super Sonico? Uh, that there aren't any more Super Sonicos. Hey, but people are throwing money in the ring to Sonico, which that is definitely a Japanese thing. Out of a, out of respect to the Japanese culture for wrestlers, they will throw the they will throw money in the ring. I never got a tip. You worked at the wrong Japanese promotion. I sure did. Uh, 
All right, we're going to be back at Top Pro Wrestling with the Soy Boy Challenge.